Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Print Pression Personal Rings Planner. And so we're going to go ahead and open it up and then I'm going to compare the kind of outside size to a Filofax Personal and then also my Carpe Diem Personal, which I found out from one of you guys is not a true personal size. And then we're also going to look at how personal Filofax size inserts fit in here and then also how um, personal wide inserts fit in here. So we're gonna go ahead and jump in. So I haven't opened this up yet. All I did was take it out of the box and it comes in a nice dust bag and the color on this is just called pink and this is their Classic Rings Planner. And honestly, I didn't realize that this company was still in business. I remember I found them a couple of years ago when I was looking at, I believe it was Traveler's Notebooks. And for some reason, I thought they went out of business or maybe they closed down. I'm not really sure, but I was very pleasantly surprised uh, to find out that they are still open and still in business. Um, and that was because Yvette from, um, I think her Instagram name is the planner mommy um shared hers and so I was really excited um and the price was definitely affordable all right so here we go so this is the pink size Ooh, okay I like it already all right so here is the pink it's definitely got a textured cover um it's definitely not smooth hopefully the camera is picking that up all right, here is the inside. So I'm pleasantly surprised it really seems to lay flat. As soon as you open it up, it does have this really large pocket in the front, which is really nice, similar to the Moterm rings that I have seen. You have some card slots right here. Um, there's a slot here and here, and then more card slots and a zipper um, on the back. Go ahead and see how that zips which is nice. Then we have a pen loop. Um, oh, that has elastic, so that is also nice. I like that there's two snaps, kind of depending on how thick your planner is, which is great. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and close this up and then we are gonna just um, compare the sizes just right on top of each other. So here's the print pression and then here is a file of fax. And they're both labeled as personal and it looks like when you lay them on top of each other let me just double check that again it looks like the print impression is a tiny bit taller um, from top to bottom side to side they look about the same okay and now I'm going to put this is uh, the carpe diem one that I have, and I'm gonna put this on top. Um, and this actually, I think the Carpe Diem is a little wider, um, but top to bottom, it looks like the print pression is a very, very small amount um, taller. Okay, now we are gonna look at inserts. And I picked this up with a very um, specific purpose in mind. Um, and I, of course, I will show you, show you guys that as soon as it is set up. So this is the size insert I have in my Carpe Diem, which these are personal wide, or um, when I got this from Kiki K, it was a B6 size. So we're gonna go ahead and pop these in and see how it closes. Okay, so let me just snap this. Let's do a wider ring. Hmm, it looks like, okay, you could put personal wides in here. Now this is just one. I don't know how it would be like if you filled it up, but it looks like it will still close and they're not gonna hang out that much. So that's good to know. And then we have a Filofax personal insert right here and on this one I did not snip these 
so we could go ahead and open these rings up. Kind of just to test it out. Okay, so that is the personal size and of course there's going to be lots of space. So I am pleasantly surprised that both of these inserts will fit both sizes. So that definitely makes me think about some things about what size I'm going to put in here. I was going to put the, um, just the Filofax size personal inserts in here, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens because I feel like this opens things up a little bit. Okay. So we will go ahead and take this one out and I'm just going to close these rings, pop this one out so I don't have to open the rings up again. Okay, so here is one last look at the cover. This says print pression and it has silver hardware. Here's the spine and the back. And it looks like that might be the only branding that's on here, except for right on the middle, it says print pression very lightly. And then if you look in the back pocket, there is a little tag right there that says print pression as well. So overall for the price, I am very happy um, with this purchase. I'm looking forward to getting it all set up. If you guys are currently using print pression, please let us know in the comments down below. Um, subscribe if you enjoy planner related content and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.